Welcome to our channel Skills Learning Network for Excellence Knowledge. Today we are in Felix lesson. In this lesson we are going to talk about Newton's first law. This law is an introduction to motion of the object and the force acting on it. In other words, it deals with the motion of an object and its relation to the force. What is Newton's first law of motion? Newton's first law of motion stated that a body remains in the state of rest or uniform motion in a straight line unless and until an external force acts on it. You can put this Newton's first law of motion in a simple words. A body will not start moving until unless until and unless an external force acts on it. Once it is set in a motion, it will not stop or change its velocity until and unless some force acts upon it once more. The first law of motion is sometimes is also known as the law of inertia. There are two conditions on which the first law of motion is depends. So how first law of motion depends? And it depends on the following object at rest depends object at rest when an object is at rest velocity is equal to zero and the acceleration is equal to zero therefore the object continues to be at rest and another object in motion when an object is in motion velocity is not equal to zero while acceleration is equal to zero therefore the object will continue to be in a motion with the constant velocity and in the same direction what is an external force an external force is defined as the change in the mechanical energy that is either kinetic energy or the potential energy in an object these force are caused by external agents. For example, of external force are friction, normal force, and the air resistance. Let us understand more first law of motion by example. Let us take a block on a smooth surface. By smooth, we mean that there is no friction acting on the surface the block is at rest that is is not moving now let us examine the force acting on the block the only force acting on the block are the force of gravity and the normal reaction by the surface there is no force acting on it in the horizontal direction since the force in the vertical direction are equal to the each other in a magnitude they cancel each other out and hence there is no external force on the block since this block is at rest we can say that it confirmed newton's first law of motion another example now if we apply constant force on the block in horizontal direction it will start moving with some constant acceleration in the direction of the applied force. Thus, the first law of motion is confirmed again. Make sure you note that Newton's law are varied only in inertia frame of reference. Newton's first law of motion can be applied in our daily life. For example, wearing a seat belt in a car while driving is an example of Newton's first law of motion. Another example, if an accident occurs or if brakes are applied to the car suddenly, the body will tend to continue its inertia and move forward, probably provide, proving the fatal. To prevent such accident, seat belt are used which stop your body from moving forward in inertia, avoiding 
a danger. That is our lesson on a first law of motion. Thank you for listening. Share this content to your fellow. Subscribe to allow notification for the coming lesson. Thank you for watching this channel.